Watch how the completed manufacturing and application of a Zycon digitally printed heat transfer label is done. This label is an industrial heat transfer label being applied to a polypropylene plastic pail. The paper manufacturer provides the base heat transfer label paper stock with a proprietary release coating. In some cases, this paper first requires a flood-coated primer to be applied. This primer allows the Zycon toner to be bonded and fused to the coated release. Here we show a substrate that has been pre-primed offline. As the image being printed is in reverse for heat transfer labels, the print stations are reversed. Black is printed first and the final print station is white. A final flood or patterned white is used if the label is being applied to a dark or colored container or product. Remember that the final heat transfer label is comprised only of the Zycon toner. No backing or liner is applied to the final container or product. The Zycon 3500 press runs a 508 mm or 20 inch wide web. This allows to print two labels across for 20 liter or 5 gallon containers. With a printing speed of 19.2 meters or 63 feet per minute, the press provides a yield of roughly 2,800 labels per hour. The Zycon industrial heat transfer label can now be further finished inline or offline. In this case, an adhesive will be applied before rewinding the label. Before the adhesive is applied, the web is run through a corona treater that adapts the surface tension of the labels. It allows for a smooth and even bond of the adhesive to the toner. A web guide ensures proper alignment of the paper during the different finishing steps. A U-coat applies a flood water-based adhesive with a flexo station. The Analox roller and accurately positioned doctor blade ensure a consistent amount of coating on the web. After coating, the water-based adhesive is run through a hot air dryer. When the label is dried, it is wound up as a master roll. Offline, this master roll is then slit into individual production rolls. The finished rolls are taken to the heat transfer label decorator. A non-mandrel round pail decorator from Tronix will apply the finished heat transfer label onto a pail. The decorator first pre-treats the surface of the container, in this case a pail, with an open air gas flame. This treatment ensures that the surface of the pail has the correct surface tension or dine level. Using a heated silicon rubber roller and pressure, the heat transfer label is then transferred onto the pail. This pressure and heat allows the label to bond to the pail and become an integral part of the pail. A printed index mark on the label and an electronic eye on the Tronix decorator are used to start and stop the application of the label so it aligns correctly on the pail. After the label is transferred and bonded to the pail, the same open flame head that provided the pretreatment now applies a post-treatment. This post-treatment seals the label bond and brings out the gloss in the label release. The pails, decorated with a Zycon digitally printed heat transfer label, are now ready for shipping or for sending directly to the fill line.